All right, guys, we're leaving. Outfit of the day includes warmness. It is freezing outside and it's also freezing in our room. This place is so dark, like there's no lights. It's really weird. <coughs> Even with the lights on, it's like really dark, so. There's a window here. That's the only reason you can see me like this. And there's our little car that we're driving. Look at it. It's so cute. This is where we're staying. It's a cute little Airbnb. I can link it below. Here we go. Just close it. It's really neat because after you close it, it just locks automatically after 30 seconds. Driving the hybrid Toyota CHR. Oh my God. I did it again. She got it on the side where you're supposed to drive. And I'm not driving. So, we didn't sleep. Actually, I'll tell you the story in a second. But the heat on is so cold. What floor is it? How many degrees is it? Oh, we don't know because it's in Celsius. Yeah, we, don't know. we didn't sleep for basically like 48 hours, except for like an hour and a half, maybe two hours. That's if we were lucky. Last night, we came back a little bit early. It was like 7.30, I think, when we got back. And at like 8.30, we took a unisom to make sure that we would sleep and Christopher got up literally like three times in the middle of the night and was like yelling at me that he needed to get something for his family to take it to them but he doesn't know what it is and I was like I don't know what you're talking about but I'm trying to sleep so if you don't shut up and get back in the bed we're gonna have a problem so that happened like three times and then this morning we basically feel like hung over from the unisom like we still want to sleep more which i know our body needs more sleep than what we got but still it's like 11 32 and we got up at 10 30 so we still slept for like 14 hours did we sleep for 14 hours for real babe i read it it says it locks after 30 seconds buddy well how long do we sleep i can't even add right now 12 long time we at least slept for 13 or 14 hours. It's, it was crazy. Moral of the story, if you want to sleep... Don't take don't Unisom. Take don't do it. This is the most difficult place to get out of, too. And it's like, okay, don't forget, opposite side of the road. Okay, because it's scary. It's so weird, isn't it? Seeing the car like this. Does anyone else in America I think this is weird? Super strange. Super strange. I'm freezing. Because the heat's not working yet. What does dual mean? What is, what is anything? Today? What can you not find? Trying to seat back. Are you bucking so up? Like, <laughs> up? Wait, do it again. I just don't know why I'm like, sitting straight up. <laughs> I don't like it. I am too. It's weird. There's not a thing. Wait, is it under? No, that's just a scoop back. What the heck? Oh, it's where is it? Part. It's on the very, very, very bottom. I can't find my. I'm just staying like this, okay? <laughs> so I don't know if you guys can see, but I have two little pom-poms on the top of my hat. I'll link all the outfits that I wore in this video. Guys, we're at Jameson and we're about to do a tour here. It's really dark. Here's Christopher. What's up, guys? All right, here we go. <laughs> so, guys, just a few things to say before we get started. The unlikely cause of like a fire or an evacuation, all you simply got to do is just follow me. Okay? You know the stairs? Everyone just came up, yeah? We'll go back down them stairs and we'll leave through the main fire exit, which is located at the bar. Is that cool for everyone? It's 1780 and set up shop. Now Dublin was going through like the midst of a boom at the time. Its population was growing dramatically. It was actually the second largest city in Britain and Ireland at the time. And there was actually well over 100 breweries and distilleries across Dublin city centre. Now many of these, they would fade away in due course. A few might have guessed it at the time. But Dublin had just gained an institution that would remain on the city's north side for over 200 years. The fur lamp down there. Oh, that's so cute. Black, red painted Love out. that. Tables. There's lights inside. Look at this, guys. It's a Jameson tree. We have to have one. We have to have one. So cute. Look how cute this little gift shop. And 
this is out where you can get your free drink and your voucher and their bar. Oh, look who's at the bar. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> I was like, huh? What? I didn't do anything. <laughs> I didn't do anything. Yes, you did. You've always done something. Look at this on the floor. You can see down at the original building. This has been here for like literally forever. And then they have the Jameson's bottles up here to make like a light fixture. in here. Dublin and we just ate at a really cool bar. It was too dark inside for me to be able to vlog in there. You guys would have never been able to see me. But it was so good. I had the Guinness beef stew and it had vegetables in it and mashed potatoes. It was so good. So now we're about to cross the street to go back to our car. Me, Christopher, and Kendall. And we're about to go back to the car. We're gonna pass this really cool building down here and I'm gonna take a picture on it for Instagram. Scooter. <laughs> here we go. Come on, Angus. Quickly, quickly. <laughs> Come on, Angus. <laughs> so this is where I'm going to take my picture for Instagram in front of this really creepy dungeon looking door. Look how green the grass is here, y'all. It's so crazy. It's like the greenest grass in the world. That could actually be an actual true statement, but I'm not sure. All right, here we go. This is where I'm taking my photo. There's a lot of trash here though. Lots of trash in Dublin. Do you guys think I should talk with an accent? Does it sound like a Dublin accent? Does it? I don't believe so. <laughs> We're window shopping. No, my AirPods are actually out. weekend. Look, look how beautiful this is in the background here. <laughs> oh, again? <laughs> Ma'am, I'm so sorry. She's going to have to make a page so that all of you guys can follow her. <laughs> We're looking for Madison, a husband. She likes the, the Irish, right? Yep, Liam's awesome. Na name name Liam your, if you're watching your dream this. guy. No, Liam, if you're watching this, flip phone Maddie. Find me. Flip ball, oh, at Flipball Maddie on Instagram. She's had that handle for like years now. Look at this though, guys. As a bus comes by, the room for me. Look at that. Isn't that building gorgeous? So pretty here. They don't really celebrate New Year's like we do in the US. Um, if they celebrate, they actually just like have their friends and family over. But like no places were open here last night, but we were all asleep anyways. But they just don't celebrate it like we do in the US. But a lot of police places were closed this morning for breakfast and they don't open until like 10.30. Someone's hollering at me. Oh, we have to go in here now. Just kidding. All right, we're walking in this place. See. Whiskey Museum. Oh, I see what you guys are doing. Trying to take me down a dark alleyway. Yeah, you're next. <laughs> I'm next. <laughs> yeah, right. You guys couldn't live without me. walking down this really cool like cobblestone road it's really hard by the way to walk on cobblestone <laughs> like it's really hard to walk on cobblestone i didn't what happened they walked by it, it was different from a waffle cone yeah it was like but a... and it was full of ice cream she come by right by and paul was like <laughs> literally right in it we gotta find where they got those i'm sure we'll pass it paula maybe they have bourbon ice cream uh -huh. <gasps> for you guys make sure to watch my youtube channel when i get back so you can watch the full videos <laughs> 
this little road is so cute. It's really hard to walk on cobblestone. Paula, can you imagine if you were in heels on this road, how terrible it would be? You would have, you would have to walk on your toes for sure. Look how cool this road is. It's awesome. We're about to get something at the Bubble Waffle. Look at this. These look delicious. Does anybody want to taste them, Maddie? <laughs> These look so good. Look, it looks like a crepe. Kiss my Barney stone. <laughs> it looks like a crepe. Oh my God, that looks so good. I can't wait. Guys, look at this church. It's so beautiful. Oh, well, I guess it's a cathedral. Look how gorgeous. Look at the top. It looks like a castle. But it's not. It's a cathedral. Look at that. How amazing. There's my family. H&M, huge store. Look at that, the architecture, the windows. Look at that, so pretty. Look at that. I'll probably have chocolate in my teeth or something. But we just went to this place called Bubble Waffle Factory. Y'all, they made this waffle in front of me. Put it in this little plastic container has homemade chocolate ice cream with chocolate chips in it and raspberries and we're like on the do you know what river this is honey nope downtown Ireland we're Dublin. in downtown Dublin on this little bridge it's so adorable look at this and all the lights back there it's so cute so now I'm gonna go away from the line you won't be able to see me but now we are going to walk and get an uber and then tomorrow we are going to um, take our rental car and go see yep here's stairs thanks for telling me that I would have died at least we would have gotten on camera um, yeah tomorrow we're gonna go to the countryside and see all the country living and the sheep and all the animals and stuff so I'm really really excited about that crossing illegal living on the edge people all right guys so funny story um last night or was it this morning i'm getting all my times confused because it's just the time difference is so crazy anyways i washed my hair my real hair not my piece and came in here i had bought two converters for me to use for all my hot tools and everything i turned my blow dryer on and fire sparks started coming out of the end of it so i was like hmm gonna have to turn that on low heat and put it on low like you know the blow speed get done with that plug in my curling iron put it on a level one out of five levels it blew up started smoking so now i basically have nothing to fix my hair with so i just have to dry it on low heat and this is it and i can't wear my volume extension because my volume extension is curly and i can't curl my own hair so i'm stuck with this seriously so annoyed also we've only been here for like one night <laughs> And look at how messy our room is already. Like seriously. Look at this. This is my beauty area. There's my blown up curling iron. And it's a really nice curling iron. So I'm really ticked off about it. And then my hair is sitting over here from the flight. Because I wore it through two flights with the last flight. I took it off while I was trying to sleep. But I didn't end up sleeping anyway. So yeah, it's pretty rough in here. But we're just going to make the best out of it because you really can't predict these types of things. Um, I'm going to link this, which it looks kind of bulky just because I have so many layers on. I'm going to link this and I have on some Carhartt pants. And I uh, have not tried any before, but I needed some thermals for this trip, so I tried it. Oh, let me fix my lens. So I fixed my lens. There we go. That's better. Anyway, so I hadn't tried on Carhartt pants before, but I absolutely love these and I'll link it below because you guys would never find it on where I got it from. And then I'll link my boots also. These have been so warm and it's perfect for if you're like in a rainy place or anything. I have really enjoyed these. 
So I'll link this, my thermals that are underneath, the um, Carhartt pants, and my socks and shoes because the socks are also really, really warm. So yeah, about to wash my face and then go to bed. And then we're waking up early to go to the countryside. So I'm really excited. See you tomorrow. Oh, and Christopher has a donut after we just ate a waffle you cone on right because you walked into it. Well, it's rice crispies. Okay, well, what kind of, I was about to say, tell the people what you're eating. It's caramel, slightly peanut butter, and it's obviously just a great donut. 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 Really good. Are you enjoying yourself? I am. You know I love donuts. So. I know you do. Alright, I'm about Not to go take a bath. Love you.